Hey everybody, Dennis here. I hope y'all can hear me with this wind, but uh, first off I want to tell everybody happy Thanksgiving. Today is Thanksgiving Day. My uh, wife's over at the in-laws cooking, so I was outside doing a little project and uh, started to sprinkle, so I took a little break and started thinking about some stuff. Uh, I think it was this past Monday, I uh, came home and decided, hey, you know what, I'm going to go throw some corn out at my blind. Um, I planned on hunting it either today or this weekend. And to my surprise, I get down here, and I've actually fixed the blind. But my blind was ripped out of the ground and shoved up against this pile of brush, you know, everything. And I had it anchored real good, so it didn't just come up. I was like, okay, you know, maybe it was the wind, whatever. And then I look down, and I start seeing ruts. I don't know how well y'all can see them, about right there, there, and there. I see ruts. I'm like, well, who's been back here? Because nobody's supposed to be back here. Again, let's see, where's my finger? Rut there. And this was the big tail right here, going all the way up right there. Because when I bush hogged all this, it was solid. And we hadn't got rain in months. So I knew somebody had been back here. And you know what? I asked everyone to stay off the property because it's hunting season. There's a, I'll, I'll walk all the way down there. There's a pond down there. This is not my land, but I have permission from the landowner to hunt. The landowner has not given anyone else permission to hunt. Which brings me to the ruts. About this first week of October, deer season had already started, but I haven't, I hadn't prepared this spot yet, or gotten it ready, I should say. And I heard some four wheelers back here, so I walk down here, and I find two people. I know I'm not gonna mention their names. They know who they are, and I ask them, "It's deer season. Please don't come back here. I don't want anybody accidentally getting hurt." And, oh, okay, you know, whatever. And I thought, point was made. Well, these folks went behind my back and asked the landowner, could they go fishing down here at the pond? And this is probably two weeks ago. And the landowner said, yes. Go fishing on the pond. Here's the pond. They didn't ask to hunt. They asked to fish. I got a text message. It was a Saturday or Sunday. I was home. And I wasn't hunting. But the text message said, Hey, don't shoot. We're down here fishing. I was like, you know what? Whatever. I'm not even going to respond to that. And apparently it's been since this. that. Uh, but, uh. They came back down here supposedly with some people we don't even know. Didn't ask to fish this time. Didn't ask to hunt. And they came down here and they killed a yearling doe. Supposedly about 80 pounds. Okay. I found a Sprite can. And let me show you all the property line. I don't know if y'all can see that marker on that tree right there. There's a marker on that tree right there. There's one right here. So, this is pretty much the property line. This is, uh, I don't know this guy that lives or owns this property, but there's a shotgun shell. <clears throat> they, they even said they shot it with a shotgun. So, from there to there is a good 15 feet. I think they were on the uh, other person's property. So, I don't know if the deer was killed on my property or the neighbor's property. Either way, it's poaching. <clears throat> and they were trespassing. I have not talked to these individuals yet. Because <laughs> I'm pissed. And their family. I'll put it that way. I'll leave it at that. But they didn't have permission. And then you kill a deer without permission. 
and then you go through my food plot, possibly, and I can't prove this, possibly knock over my blind. Hell, they may have been hunting out of my blind for all I know, other than the fact that I found that shell. I thought they may have been hunting out of it. But then you go and you trespass on my property in a truck, rut up my food plot, or my shooting lane, and don't even bother to come knocking on the door and say, hey, you know, we did this. Because you know why you didn't do that? Because you feel guilty. Because you know you're doing wrong. And unfortunately for me, the landowner that owns this land that I hunt on won't do, won't do anything about it. But anyway, that's my rant for today. I'm going to try to get back to work. And uh, you know what, people? I have more respect for other people's property. Just bullshit. Straight up. Disrespectful. I hope everybody has a great day. Please comment, rate, and subscribe, and happy Thanksgiving.